Hello everyone. Today I'm just um, going to explain about like the hills and the sun and basically landscapes really, and just nice views. So what I'm about to do is go up the hill now. I'll go get there and just you know chill. Look at that. Somewhere over there, man pretty nice actually yeah so basically what I'm trying to talk about is um, just like hills you see me going up now it's getting steeper and steeper and I'm just like gonna explain like how how it gets here and like how it's been here for like hundreds of hundreds or thousands of years talking about the Sun as well and just and views as well so when you go up a hill what do the views look like so you probably know what they are because you've probably been on before but I'm gonna have a look at this one and I'm gonna show you. See if you look here, can you tell that it's getting steeper all the time? So basically that's what I'm going to explain to you about. I tell you that sounds nice. Come on, I love sunsets, that's my my opinion. Not opinion, sorry. Sunsets is my thing that I like. I mean you may not like it, even if I keep going on about it, but come on, they are spectacular. Just listen to my new Coldplay music album. It's brilliant, I love it. In the night, the stormy night, she closed her eyes. In the night, the stormy night, away she flied. Every time she closed her eyes. <sighs> Haven't been up here for about a month and three weeks now, but it's just gorgeous, really gorgeous. Look at that, just so stunning. So here's one shot of a nice view. It's really nice actually, I like it. So you've got the sun over there, these trees, and you've got all the landscape. I just think it's, you know, really good, brilliant. Just so spectacular to watch out. I could, could sit up here for hours. Yeah, so I haven't been here for about a month and three weeks now since the last time I came in, it's changed a lot. It's, it's got grass on here, it's got all the new crops over there. Not crops, what are they called? Leaves, or I don't know what they're called, but on this field here, I'll show you. I don't have a clue what they're called, but these things here, that's what they are. Or whatever they are, but it's green. That's all I wanna say. That's just so spectacular. What I'm gonna do as well, we're gonna, I'm gonna walk all the way around there, go all the way over there, and then there's some hills behind those trees. And I'm going to go all the way down there, we're going to go for a walk as well. So I just want to show you this first bit. I shall do that when the sun gets a bit more lower. When it gets a bit more lower. I think hills um, are made from hundreds of years ago, I think. I think how this hill um, formed was um, probably, probably somehow we made it. Us humans made it. Because... If you look at it right, you see, how, you see how curved the shape is, I mean like how smooth it is, just like how the hill is proper like that. Usually if our people, like if there's our hillsides in other countries where a lot of people don't go, where it's actually just in the middle of nowhere, it'll be more bump, bumpier or stuff like this, but since there's tractors have gone across this, it's all smoothed out. And since that's happened throughout the years, it's gotten smoother and that's what makes hills probably. Yeah, so I, th I think probably, sort that out here, yeah, so I think probably, it was us that made it, so probably hundreds of years. It was all mashed up, and then it like builds up. Probably it's like started building up, and then we go over it with our tractors, and then it made a nice proper hill, nice curved shaped hill, which is good as well because I'm learning my snowboarding lessons, and I'm gonna come, I'm gonna come here when it starts snowing in December of 2011, and when it does, I'm gonna come here and see this hill here and all the other hills where we're gonna go soon. I'm going to snowboard down it with sledges, yeah my snowboard, when I get one soon. And the reason I come here right now, because since you know there's a recession and like the credit crunch and that stuff going on about the government and all that, I haven't got no job. I've got one job, but it's only a part time one, only once a week, but I don't start again until the 23rd of December. And I just come here and do my shops really, sometimes when I get bored. Yeah, so I usually come here when I'm bored, really. When there's something to do, seriously, because there's there's literally millions of people out there with no jobs, and 
a lot of people can't like you know do much things because they haven't got much money. So, and since I since I'm unemployed at the moment, I just come here sometimes when I'm bored. I, c I just come here and just watch the nice view. That's why I'm here right now because I'm bored. So I'm just making a a film for you lot to have a look at it. And also I know, I know things about this. I've because when I was younger I used to I used to love nature and all that, and I still do now. I, I first I wasn't interested in it when I just when I was. 15, 16 years old, 17 years old, but then ever since I turned 18, like made videos, I just start loving it again. What I'm saying is, I'm not saying I'm getting rid of it out of my, out of my life. I, it's still with me. I still know the knowledge and all of that about nature and stuff like that, and pl and the planet being green and all that, eco-friendly, and keeping the environment stuff like that. That's the stuff I was like interested in, and then I wasn't, and now I am again. There's a lot of green hat, there's a lot of gases at the moment, carbon dioxide to power, power our stuff and all that, and we need to make a, make, make a difference basically. Yeah, so I think that's how hills are made, so we made them, I think. Probably hundreds of years ago they were just all bouncing like a hill, probably like that, all damaged, and then ever since we've got tractors and all that, proper tractors, cutting edge, te cutting edge technology, now we can like use the proper tractors to like go over them and then make them nice and smooth and shaped and that's how this is, look even the same with that side and you can see all the other hills over there, it's just spectacular view, you can see all the houses, all the cars going past I really like it, a nice view of the sun yeah two people just walked um, past me a moment ago and they were just down there and they were just standing there took a picture and they were just looking at the view, see what I mean, so if, if people are up here they would just stop and look what it is, a spectacular view. It's November now and it's getting cold. Can't wait till it snows because when it does I'm going to snowboard down these and I'll make a video about it. Definitely, Matt, can't wait. Yeah, boy. such a stunning view. Stunning. Anyway, shall we move on? Go to the next hills over there? So, let's get going then. Right, moving on to the next hill now. The view is just absolutely spectacular. Oh, so gorgeous. This is a day I'll never forget. Oh look, a bench. Did my chilling out video here, look. Do you remember? I had my camera over here. And I had me jumping on here, didn't I? Do you remember? And I went across there. Yeah, let's put the tripod down for you. Oh, just look how stunning that is. This is going to take some time to walk around 
up to the big hills. I'm on the dark side now where there's no sunlight. So I'm, gonna, I'm doing this so I can get to the sunlight, but I've got quite a while to get to. So I'm going to make a few runs for it, and I'm going to get to um, going to get to the other side of the hills, and then I'll come back here again for when it's the sunset, which shouldn't be too long now. Let me chip me iPhone. Oh, heard that shooting. It's 3:20 now. The sun will set at 4:30 today. Can you hear that? They're doing shooting. I wouldn't mind doing it, but I think it's a bit cruel cool sometimes. I have to keep, they keep killing animals. They do this like every weekend. Really don't like it. Really makes me annoyed. It does. I don't mind doing it, but like every twice a year. Not 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 bloody every single day or every weekend. That's too much. Because we need animals. They keep shooting, and what's going to be left? They'll get extinct, won't they? Oh, uh, but I'm not shoot. I'm not doing hunting at the moment. So let's get some uh, nice view here as well. Look over there. Got a nice house cottage over there. It's a nice hill, really. Yeah, that's what I want to go for walks and all that. Right, time to get going to the other side now. Gonna take a while. Gonna take a while. <sighs> oh, I'm almost here now. I'm on the second bit of the hill. I've just got to get over those trees, and then I'll be there to the big one. I think, oh, is it that one actually? Hang on. Oh no, it's not. No, is it that one? Looks like it. Well, I'm gonna go around there, and then go down there. Well, let's get going then. I'm inside a little forest now. Looks like someone's here burning their fire. See, and I've got some logs here ready to come across these. I did, yeah. We go through these woods and check them out. Quite an exciting adventure, really. This looks really good. I just want to check something quickly. Still listen to Coldplay Paradise, the best song ever at the moment. I tell you, this place is quite scary. I jumped, I did earlier on, because I, I was, went over here and I saw Bunny, went all the way past I did. God, there's cobwebs everywhere. But I think we're here now. Here's the end bit. I think, we're, I think this is it. Oh, God. I think we're on the back of the hill, not the front. I want to get to the front. I tell you, I'm enjoying myself at the moment. It's like an adventure. Ah, look at this. Look. Rabbit hole. That's a big one. Bloody hell, what was that noise? <laughs> okay, I've got a duck underneath here. Uh, uh. Wow. Made it to the other side. Look at that. Look at that landscape. I think we're at the back of the hill at the moment. Let's wait for the forest to shortcut around there. Oh, bloody cobwebs. Wow. That is absolutely stunning at the end there's a lot of comments for you to say when I say leave a comment below it's gonna be a lot of that we've made it I think yeah, we've made it I swear we have, have we Oh no, I don't have... Hmm. Let's have a look. I'm going to go up here anyway and just have a check out. Yeah, this is it! <sighs> Woo! <sighs> Made it. I'm still at the back of it. I want to get to the front there, but I don't want to go on the field. Because it could be... Illegal. I think it is illegal actually. I mean, it's only land though, I'm not harming it or anything. It's just that it's a gorgeous fear, but I'm probably going to go back there, down there, then have a look at that site. But that view is so stunning, but I've made it. I've made it. Oh, my God. I'll never forget this day, I won't. Never forget this day. Why is it snowballing now? I'm gonna sneak up on there. 
hope there's like no farmer about because this is farmer's property I think I exactly, I exactly know where we are now we we'll go right back and then have a look I'll tell you right when I went through that forest to get to on this side of the field that'll be really stunning when it snows I'll tell you when it, I think this year's going to snow it's November at the moment and it'll be December in about three weeks time so no, not three weeks time sorry that's Christmas so it'll be so check it out it'll be about two weeks time when it's December no not two weeks time um about a week and a half something like that but in about three weeks time it'll be Christmas but between, between during those times hopefully it will snow and all of this lot seriously I'll record this all of this including over there where I did my bit of a bit first at the beginning all of this will be so stunning with the snow out and the sun just love the sun there oh yeah I'll talk, I'll talk to you a bit about that right when I came here last time on the hill I was at the beginning the sun when it started it was about here in February 2011 and then it moved over there and I thought it would go round and then back to where it was but it didn't it did this it was really weird it did this you know it was there it went across there stayed there till July August and when it was September it moved back here and now it's there so probably December that sun will be about there this time it could be it's really weird I thought it goes around in a cycle but probably because since the earth's gravity is not actually going around in a proper circle it's probably going in a length a length shape just like so here's the sun it's not going like that it's going like that so it could do something like that it could just you know well let me sh let me show you right so um, you see that you see that that's the sun right Oh hell, I need to find a bit of something that can represent the earth. Aha, here we go, right. That's the sun, here's the earth, right. It doesn't go round in a year in a proper circle. It probably goes like this. It could do. I know a lot about the universe. It could do that. I'm not saying it could, but it possibly could. Because the sun's over there. It was over there, and now it's gone back there again. Which is spectacular. I'm actually glad about that, because that means I can see it again. From back to where it was. It's just so stunning, though. Oh, oh, I can't get it down there because there's fencing. Do you know what? I'll go back, going back again, and then I'll go down that hill and then just go back down there. That's all I can do, really. So, yep, we'll see what happens. Yep. I really want to go over there, but I have to go across this. Or I'll just start going down there. Well, that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to start going down there. See, look how beautiful the sun is now. Oh, gorgeous. 100% I'm going to make a video called Something Sunsets or just Sunsets or whatever. I, I, I was going to call it HJ Sunsets or The Beauty of Sunsets. Or I may just call it Sunsets. So, we'll see what happens though, but I'm definitely going to make one for you. I promise you I'll make one. Trust me. Oh, but trust me. Trust me on this right, when it does snow, and I'll bring my snowboard here, when I, if I can afford to buy one soon, I shall actually sneak across that field. And if I see the farmer, I'll just ask permission. First, if I can, you know, um, go down there on my snowboard. Don't see why not. What, 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 am I, what am I doing? Am I destroying the hill? No. There's no point in destroying the crops because it's winter, isn't it? There's no crops there, it's just a plain field with grass. See, look. Oh, it went a bit dark there. I don't know why it did that, but anyway. All this is grass, including over there. Oh, look at that. Let me zoom in for that. Look at that. Oh, man, that is beautiful. I think I know where I am now. See all these rabbit holes, look. So, yeah, that's what hills are like, I think, because we made them. So they're all bumpy hundreds of years ago, all built up. Then we went across them and made it smooth. Now it's cool. Now it's a hill, and it's good as well because we can go snowboarding on it, stuff like that. And the landscape is beautiful as well. Just uh, seeing the whole countryside. Countryside's wonderful. Ah ha! I know where I am now. 
I do know where I am. I abso absolutely know where I am now. Shouldn't really go across this because it's field property. How oh, in God's name am I going back? I'm going to probably go up this way and then back round again. Because I can't go across this because it looks like a path, but it's not. So I'd have to go. Uh. All the way around again, back down to that hill. That's what I'm going to do now, so I'm going to go back. I'm going to go back, and then I'll get there. Actually, I'm going to go around this way instead, because that way is blocked off. So I'm back here again, look, there's the sun. And there's the hill I wanted to go over across, but I'd, I'd rather not. And there's the sun again. If I see a farmer around, I'll ask permission for him. To be honest, though, I'd rather snowboard on the other side of the hill, not here. Cause, but the problem is, if I snowboard on this side, there'll be no no people about and the snow will be bigger if there's more people sledging down with the snow it down the hill it'll, the snow will get less and less so if I can get permission to do it here there'll be more snow about that much on the ground but then when it and it's thick and hard and solid and smooth and slippery and freezing cold <laughs> and icy I'm not gonna go back through the forest way forget that it looks dark already in there Ooh. Scary man, imagine doing this at night. I would love to, but not on my own. I'll do it with someone else. Then I'll be more confident. <sighs> Made it round the other way now. I can, I can tell you how dark it's gotten so quickly. Just come all the way round, and now I'm going down here. Just to um, catch the view of the first hill at the front. Cause I was, uh, at least I made it at the back, that's good. And the sun's setting. Oh my god, the sun, man, it's so beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Not beautiful, Be beautiful. Wonderful, beautiful. <laughs> oh. oh god, so funny. The sun's wonderful, and beautiful. <laughs> and all the trees over there look so good. <laughs> All this trees and that. Check out this sunset. Wow. Bloody hell. Just look at that. God, man, it's setting so quickly. I've got an app on my iPhone that tells you exactly what the time when the sun sets. I said 4.30, but let's have a look if it is 4.30. I think I'm right. God, it's setting even quicker now. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's called Sunrise and Sunset. I know I've got it wrong. It sets at 4.05, not 4.30. I'm sorry about that. See, look says there sunset 405 it's like that for you to make it see better look 405 i thought it was 430 but well it's 4 401 now as you can see oh and two there you go 401 so look at the sun now Just wow. I've had a nice, really good day today. All the way. Have a nice, uh, nice walk. So, what have we done today? Then? So, we've done looking at the sun, hills, landscape, and walking. All sorts, really. Loads of things I've done today. It's just really spectacular. I'm glad I've, sh I'm glad I've shown it to you. And I hope you've enjoyed it. Yeah, I'm enjoying it right now still. I mean, the sun sets so quickly. When you look at it, it's spectacular. The sun's completely gone now. It's just um, just the, the clouds on top of it with the orange sky. That's it now. So which is quite nice. <sighs> Ooh, I'm tired. Ooh, I'm tired now. That's what it does, don't it? When you go out for a nice day, you get exhausted in the evening at the end of it. Well, the reason why the sun's setting now, because 
the clocks go back, don't they? And it sets quicker. Basically, it should have been, um, what's the time now? Hang on, let me check. Oh, 403, it should, it would basically, if it was still summer, it would be 503 now, but it's 403. So I'm just going down this bit here, look, down, down here, and then there's another bit there, but I may go up there, because they got that path there, and then go across, and then back to the main pit where I started, the main part where I started. There's a lot of planes out at the moment, oh, oh god, it's a helicopter. Whenever I'm around these areas, it feels like I'm doing something wrong, and I'm on a pub public footpath I was, but over there I wasn't, but it's still a, like a track, you know, like this. So I don't see what was wrong with that. Oh well, I don't care. If they, if the police or police or whatever come after me and ask me why I'm on here, I'm just saying I'm making a film, film, documentary, not film, documentary. Said the wrong thing. Oh, it feels like I'm walking with Jeremy Clarkson on Top Gear because he goes to like landscapes like this with cars and going down hills and rapids and all that. Possibly. Yeah. Feels like it. Feels like I should have James May, Richard Hammond, and Jeremy Clarkson here. Back to the main hill now. Back where I was. And look how dark it's gotten. It's gotten dark so quickly. Do you know what I mean? And all the all the village and the town is all like lit up now. And there's a uh, the sun over there, that's where the sun was before, but now it's completely gone. All you can see is the edges of the orange sky with the blue. Just the blue here and then all the darker bits of the clouds, which is so beautiful. Beautiful and wonderful and lovely. So stunning, look at the blue sky. Just, you know I mean? Just amazing. Ugh. So anyway, we're back here now. Back to where we were. As I can show you. A lot of planes about at the moment, but... So I'm just back to the main hill now, and the whole village is just beautiful. So anyway, I'm going to get going home now because it's getting so cold now. My hands are freezing now, so I'm going to go home now. So yeah, I've really enjoyed it today. And just all the nice food and all that. So anyway, I'm going to go home now. So I'll see you in a moment. Oh, just got back in. And I've really enjoyed this day, it's had a nice day out and all that, for a walk and all that, and I'm glad I showed you all. Oh, I'm really hungry now, so I'm going to go and have some food. Oh, I love the taste of me crumpets. So there we have it, people. I hope you enjoyed it. And I've enjoyed it myself, just going across the countryside, showing you about the hills, nature and uh, the sun and all that stuff, just showing you all, all sorts of nature and all that, and just going for a walk really, and I've enjoyed the walking and all that stuff today, so yeah, I've really enjoyed it. So leave a comment below, telling me what you think about the countryside, the hills, uh, the sun, and may go and walk in, all that, and through the forest, and all, all sorts of things really. Oh, and there's a new thing I'm going to say now, what you like, or what you don't like about it. So leave a comment below, tell me what you think about countryside, what you like, or what you don't like about it. And thank you for watching this video on HJ's Documentaries. Take care and I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye.